If you're getting this error that says media offline whenever you pull a file into DaVinci Resolve, there's two ways to fix it. The first one is to right click on the file and relink selected clips. This will point your folder to the proper folder where your files are stored and make sure it points to your video file, which was in my downloads folder and then collect select folder. If that doesn't work, there's another fix as well. You can download a program called Handbrake and it'll allow you to convert the file to the proper format. So for my example, um, my file is in the wrong format and I'll show you what I mean. So I'm gonna, I opened Handbrake and I'll show you how to download that in a second. You just drag your file in, it'll scan it. And then I can see here my file is 1440 by 1440 and I want my YouTube video to be 1080p. So I'm gonna preset and I'm gonna do 1080p 30 and I'm just gonna click start encoding. After just a moment, it'll save the file to this output folder here. And then I can go to that folder and I can pull in the new video. Now that it's done, I'm going to grab that file and I'm gonna put it in here and delete out the other original file. So now you can see my video is in the proper compatible format to use in DaVinci Resolve. To download Handbrake, go to Google and type in Handbrake download or click the link that I provided in the description. For me, I have Windows 10, so I'm gonna get the EXE installer. It should start downloading automatically. Once it's done, click the EXE, run it as admin, and then uh, just install it. Once it's done installing, just go to your start menu and type in Handbrake and click on it. Once it's open, you can just take your folder where your file is and you can drag and drop it into Handbrake. And then you can pick whatever kind of file you want. For me, I'm just gonna do 1080p 30 for YouTube and then you can pick where you want it to save and then click start encoding. After a moment, it'll output the file to this folder and from there you can drag and drop it into DaVinci Resolve. I hope this video helped you. If it did, please consider liking and subscribing.